Hello friends from YouTube, this is Jorge Silvestrini. We're going to talk today about making a clone, making a backup of our Mac. In this case, I am using Mavericks already 10.9 and I'm going to show you how to do this backup using Carbon Copy Cloner. You'll see the address uh, here pop up where you can download this demo, this trial, and you'll have it for 30 days, and then you can buy it. Um, perhaps you can get a great deal now on Black Friday, Cyber Monday, I'm pretty sure. They are going to have some amazing deal uh, going on. So, we're just gonna press trial here. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. That was a window sound, and that's not gonna happen. Happens to be that I have a Windows machine that I'm doing updates to on the other side. Okay, so we're going to select our source. For me, the source is this Untitled One SSD. Okay, and right now, if, if I leave it there, you'll see uh, all the information about it, Mac OS version 10.9 and what it's used, what's available. So I'm going to select it. I'm not going to do anything else. Just gonna select it. And then on destination, I am going to select another hard drive. Um, in this case, I'm going to select this MT750 gigabyte. And here comes our options. We could temporarily archive anything that will be modified in the destination or at the destination. We could delete anything that doesn't exist, which is the one I'm going to choose. Or we could preserve uh, files. I'm going to choose delete anything that doesn't exist on the source because I want it to be an exact copy. And this is the most important thing here between the clone and the backup. When we're cloning, we will be able to boot from this other hard drive or this clone that we are creating. So if we have a hard drive crash, if something will happen or would happen, we can come back and just boot from another hard drive and two minutes later, we're working again. So that's why I want to encourage you to make clones of your working system. Then all I'm gonna do after selecting delete anything that doesn't exist is uh, I'm gonna press clone. I'm gonna talk a little bit more over here, we can unlock this by pressing uh, and using our password. And then over here, we could schedule the task uh, for later today, for tomorrow, whenever we need to schedule it. Um, and we'll just, it'll just pop up this and we, we can just tell it whenever we want to schedule it, etc. Okay, so I'm going to cancel out of that. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and clone it right now to my MT750. I'm going to press clone. It's uh, just asking, hey, are you sure of what you want to do? Because I'm on, about to erase and delete everything. So continue. And it didn't ask me for the password because we had already unlocked it here. Um, and now it's just telling me from Untitled to MT750 and it's cloning. It's doing it's magic. So I'm going to pause here and come back once this is done to show you the screens. Okay guys, so as we finish the backup, we're gonna see this new prompt here, backup completed successfully. It took about 22 minutes. It copied about 11.67 um, gigabytes. Then you have your, please purchase a carbon copy cloner or okay, I'm gonna press okay. And we are done so as i now move into the finder and you'll see that this is the new finder in mavericks which has tabs so i've got uh, the hard drive that we just cloned on title one and then i'm going to show you now where we clone to and it is exactly the same see it so that's how we are going to clone our hard drives using Carbon Copy Cloner.
please like this video on YouTube. Please send me any comments, any questions that you may have. There's three ways you can communicate with me. One of them is via email, and the email address is me, M -E, at jorgesilvestrini.com. The next one is via Twitter. You can find me at J Silvestrini. And the last one is on Google Plus. Find me plus Jorge Silvestrini. Hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Keep coming back for new tips, tutorials on the YouTube channel and on my website, www.jorgesilvestrini.com. Suenalo.